Welcome to part 12 of 18 in the B300 series engine rigging video series. References for governing RPM checks and feathering adjustments can be found in the B300 series maintenance manual chapters 76-10-15 page 601 and 61-20-03 page 501. Perform an engine start as per the aircraft's pilot operating handbook. Ground run the engine for approximately 5 minutes while monitoring all engine parameters to ensure stabilized operation. Place the propeller lever into the full forward position. Then, while monitoring the engine parameters, move the power lever forward. Make sure that the propeller maintains 1700 RPM. Move the propeller lever aft until it is just forward of the feather detent. Make sure that the propeller maintains 1400 to 1420 RPM. If either the minimum or the maximum propeller RPM is out of tolerance, then the propeller minimum and maximum RPM can be adjusted. Do not attempt to adjust the propeller governor while the engine is running. To adjust the maximum RPM, rotate the maximum RPM stop screw located to the right of the propeller governor speed control. Remove the safety wire from the propeller governor max RPM adjustment screw and loosen the jam nut. Rotate the screw clockwise to decrease or counterclockwise to increase the maximum RPM. One turn of the stop screw changes the maximum speed by approximately 50 RPM. After adjusting the propeller governor, recheck the maximum propeller speed. More than one adjustment may be necessary in order to achieve the proper RPM. Once the propeller governor maximum RPM check has been satisfied, Retighten the jam nut and safety wire the stop screw. For further information, please make sure to watch the next video in the B300 series engine rigging video series. For technical assistance, please contact Textron Aviation Team Turboprop Technical Support at 316-676-3140 or 1-800-429-5372. Team Turboprop can also be reached at kingair underscore support at txtav.com.